Hello dear friends, uh, today we will learn the uh, deflection of beam having the change of EI by Castig Law's theorem now here. Suppose this is a beam, cantilever beam is subjected to 10 kN per meter and having not a uh, uniform EI. Suppose this is having 1 EI and this is having the 2 EI. This length is 3 meter and this length is 2, 2 meter. And we require to find the deflection at the B, at the free end. So, the first step is to make the section in case of the Castellos theorem. So, now uh, apply the uh, sections where the EI changes. So, here is one section for this EI and second section is for this EI. Now, the second step is draw the uh, same beam, same structure and remove the loads and apply the unit force where we desire the a deflection so we apply here the force p so what is the first step is to make the sections as per the change of ei then draw the same beam and remove the loads and apply the p force where we desire the uh, deflection now the formula is what anywhere deflection that delta is equal to so this is delta b integration m into del mx by del p into the dx upon ei so this is our section number one is section number two so process is what origin then limit then ei then mx here is the mx and del mx by del p so for first section we are keeping the origin is b our limit is from this 0 to 2 and for this section this ei is ei now the bending moment is what for this section is 10 suppose this is now the our x so, minus 10x square by 2. Now, same for the same, same section, bend moment for this fictitious beam, that is P into the x, that becomes minus Px. And derivative of this mx with respect to the P, with respect to the P, so this is the minus x, because this becomes the constant is 0, and derivative of this minus Px is minus x. Now, for the second section, again we are keeping the origin is same, that is the B. And now this is our X for the second section. So again bending moment for this section is, now limit is what? Now our origin is B, so our limit is now 2 to 5. Because already 0 to 2 is completed, now we are keeping the origin is same, so limit is now 2 to 5. Now for this section, this EI is 2 EI. Now bend moment for this section is now what? Here yeah. is 10 into x into x by 2. Hugging bend moment that is by minus 10 x square by 2. And here also this is now x for this force. So again what? Is P into x. Now derivative of this section uh, equation with respect to the P that again the minus x. So now our delta B is equal to integration 0 to 2. This becomes minus 5 x square minus Px into minus x dx by Ei. Then plus integration 2 to 5 minus 5 x square minus p into x into minus x here now dx by 2 ei now this p is our now is fictitious force so put here p is equal to 0 as per the procedure so now this equation modified 0 to 2 it becomes this becomes p equal to 0, this determinant is 0 and this minus this minus become plus, this becomes 5 
एक्स क्यू डी एक्स अपॉन ई आई प्लस इंटीग्रेशन टू टू फाइव नाउ अगेन हियर पी इक्वल टू जीरो जीरो माइनस माइनस प्लस इज फाइव एक्स स्क्वेर डी एक्स अपॉन टू ई आई सो सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस टू इक्वे टू इंटीग्रेशन इज फोर हंड्रेड पॉइंट सिक्स टू फाइव डिवाइड बाय ई आई इज दिफ्लेक्शन एट बी इन द बीम हैविंग द चेंज ऑफ ई आई सो वट इज द प्रोसीजर इन केस ऑफ द चेंज ऑफ द ई आई दैट इज यू हैव टू मेक द सेक्शन इन एवरी चेंज ऑफ द ई आई एंड फॉलो द रूटिंग प्रोसीजर Thank you